It's only a little something But why does it feel like it's true something? We just vibe and we just crazy, baby What's up, YouTube? It's Carlissa Victoria back with another video Excuse me, in this video, all my makeup, put this over here. This video, we're just going to be talking about my brow pencil that I just picked up from the Dollar Tree or Dollar General. It's two dollars, alley colors, dark brown. Just, I'm just going to be trying this out. I'm trying to actually start finding brow pencils that are cheaper, like, um, I don't have to spend as much money on, but does the job and it looks like quality. So I'm going to actually try this pencil out on the camera. These are my brows right now. There's no, there's no like, makeup or anything on my brows. These are my freaking brows. You guys see? Do we see? They're real. There's no pencil. You guys see, there's none. There's no brown pencil on my hands because these are my real brows. So basically, I brushed them out. So this is in the color, um, I just know it was like dark brown, but I feel like each of these things should have like names. It's just dark, it's called dark. I don't think you can see that, but right here, like my camera's not as focused. I don't know if you just, you probably still can't see it, but basically, come on, bro. It's still not focusing, but anyway, it's in the color dark. Um, dark brown, basically, so. It has an angle tip, which a lot of times I like that because you can just go in the angle of your brow. But then also, sometimes I like to just turn it and start this way. So I'm going to get enough out. You kind of want to relax your brow. You don't want to, you know, be in that, like, like fur on your brows because that can, like, mess up the shape. So, obviously, each brow pencil is a little different. So, I, it kind of takes me getting used to one to know how I can really, like, work it. But right now, I'm not going to lie to you, this is in the color dark, and obviously I have to work with this brush to see how it's going to end up coming out, but I could tell you right now, like, once I get a handle on the proper usage and the proper amount to use in this brush, I could tell you that this actually seems like something I could buy over. Like, yes, my eyebrows are a bit long, I'm probably going to have to take that down a notch, but I'm just trying to really test out the pencil. And I don't like really using a pencil like when it's newly fresh, like fresh, because it just takes a while before you can actually utilize it properly. So basically, I'm just adding this because I want to first ma make sure that my color matches. I'm not trying to perfect my brows because like that's just not the type of party it is. I'm just trying out the LA Colors two dollar brow pencil to see if this is something that I can continue to buy. I mean, just let's face it. Who wants to spend 20 something dollars on a brow pencil that's really good when they could spend two dollars on another brow pencil that's really good at the Dollar General or the Dollar Tree? Yeah, Dollar General. So obviously it's a little dark and I don't think, like, I think the pencil is great. I just think I'm a little heavy handed because, like I said, it's my first time using it. But you kind of want to go in with your brush a little bit and you can kind of rake out the darkness. I just do it like that and if it gets too thin you can always go back and brush it a little bit so you guys see like I just thinned out my brows by doing that so what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually take this and I'm going to come back underneath I'm going to come back underneath and I'm going to fill in what I just took away so so far like when I'm looking at the color blend of my brows times this pencil Yes, I'm a little heavy handed right now just because I'm trying to see how to work it. You know how I'm gonna work this pencil when I use it. 
but I definitely feel like I'm gonna be buying this pencil again. Um, Two dollars, and it, I'm, I'm feeling like I'm getting results. Like I was using my Anastasia brush, like heck yeah. So, like I said, I'm just gonna brush mine out a little bit because I don't like my brows to be too dark. And then I'm gonna have to go back and fill in on some places. They look a mess. The brows look a mess with me doing them, but the pencil doesn't look a mess. You know, like I'm heavy handed right now, so imagine when I'm light handed, they're gonna actually look better. And um, they're not gonna look as, like right now, there's no definitive shape. They're rounded on one. The other one's more squared. Like it's a lot going on right now with these brows of mine. But this is what they look like so far. Trying to make sure they're sisters, not lovers. This is what they look like so far. And like I said, it is a little dark and I keep trying to brush it out. But every time I try to brush them out, my brows are getting thinner. So, and I try to be careful brushing them out because you don't want to brush out your actual eye. So this is what they look like, right? So I'm gonna actually take I'm gonna take my brow pencil, which I already know. This touched, um, I remember when I was using this, this did touch like my eye, eyeliner. So I'm gonna try to wipe off the black eyeliner at the tip. You just wanna make sure your brushes are clean or just wiped off before you use them, so. Looking for oh here it is everything from here to there. So I'm gonna just try to use this concealer. Sometimes it goes like everywhere, so I have to be really careful. So. Just gonna gonna follow through with this. This concealer, I normally just put this up with no top, and it's starting to make an effect because when I put it on, it's actually drying. It's drying out when I apply it. That's why when I use my beauty blender, you guys have been seeing instead of me like dabbing the concealer in, I've been like super rough trying to blend it because I think it's like drying out from the fact that I normally just put it up with no top because I think I either trashed the top or it's just MIA. And like I said, I'm just doing a live LA color, like a test of this brown, dark. It's in the color dark, like I said. I'm just doing a test run of the pencil. Like I said, they're a little bit darker than I would like, but that doesn't mean that the pencil is too dark. I just think, again, I'm gonna keep reiterating this, that I was heavy handed when applying it. That's all that happened. So you kinda wanna try to make them as even as you can on both sides. Look at them, see if, like, are we working with this? Do I need to fix anything before I use my beauty blender? So I just try to make sure I, you know, get my ends. And I come over here and I try to mimic the same way on the ends here. And now I'm gonna use my beauty blender.
see I'm just gonna rub it in just because like I said I've been noticing that like me just trying to dab blend it's not working because honestly I think it's because that lid is being left off it's just it's like drying once I put it on it's drying instead of staying moist for me to blend it so this is what my brows look like to somebody these are the perfect brows to myself it's like sis you want a little dark you need to chill out so I don't know I just wanted to show you guys what this whole thing turned out like but that's pretty much my two dollar LA color brush in comparison to my um remember my Morphe brush was five and then my um Anastasia, Anastasia or Anastasia brush was 20 so I think I just found the brow brush that I'm going to be using for a while. We'll see how long it lasts, but it was only $2 and I think I can achieve some popping brows. Obviously, these are not the best set of brows, but we needed to test out the color. We needed to see what it was about. Um, like right here, I can like tidy that up, but we just needed to see what these brow pencil was about. And honestly, if I take my time and I do what I need to do, I think that this pencil can be literally literally can be in the lineup of pencils so i hope you guys enjoyed this video this is what the color looks like again oh these are too long honey over here these are too long but anyway like i said i wanted to do a product review on the pencil and wanted to do a uh, color review pencil was phenomenal on a scale of one to ten for two dollars i would give it an 11 so off the charts very good so i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you like comment um, share subscribe and until next time until next time, until next time, I'll see you beautiful people in the next video. It's only 11 something, but why?